So I just changed my project plan a little bit. I was going to use a DSLR to take a picture of people, but like here's an example. This is what I was kind of going for at first. Um, sorry. This look kind of, but then I saw these instructables and I thought those were really cool, just like little animals. And so I've been working on a fox. And here is it so far. Reload. Okay. Um, so pretty much what I had to do so far is I had to go to view and show a grid. And that's what these little red dots are. So these are kind of to help make sure all the triangles with the pen tool I made all snap together. So I'm so far at like 92 right now. Um, so they that's so they're all snapping together. So I can just go down this line, and then when there's a little circle, like there's a plus right now, there's a circle there. That means I've connected them. I press enter, and then that's how I finish it. And then I, I just have to finish all those and make sure I'm doing it in a place like this is all that kind of same darker white. And this is all that brighter white right there, or orange, sorry. So that's how I can fill them in later so that it's all, when I do the shapes, it doesn't all just blend together. And you just have to do that for all of them. And to get rid of this, you press first shape, go up to your top shape, or sorry, go to your top shape, press shift, and then click the last shape, and then it'll highlight all of them. And then to get rid of the lines, you just press the stroke. Here's the snap to grid. So when you're on this, you can first go to um, show. And that's how you got the grid on there, those little red dots. And then snap to, snap to grid, you click that on. And then, then you can snap to all of those. So after I learned how to do the pen tool, I learned a bunch of commands. That was another thing that I wanted to learn. Um, so I found this, and most of them transfer over. It was like an older version. Um, and this is the reason why I had to learn this new thing called Snap to Grid on the Photoshop app. Because you first go to View, and then drag down, and it says Snap to, and then Snap to Grid. Because otherwise you have to fix all of this stuff. Like every little thing you have to move around so there's not that white space in between. Um, I also learned the importance of having a good picture because I learned about pictures that are um, too grainy or have too small of triangles. Like right there, there's that little tiny triangle and that's not going to look good in an end result picture. 